Thank you for choosing our video. Today we are going to be reacting to non sharithal Special thank you to everyone who requested this video. We are looking forward to watching it with you. But first we're going to introduce ourselves. I am Erin. I'm Emma. I'm Sunshine. I'm Big Man the Savage. I'm Dan. We are Life Meets Family and we post videos on YouTube every day. So if you enjoy this video, please go down and click the subscribe button so that you can join our family and watch videos with us every day. For now, let's get this one started. Yeah, thank you if you thank you to you guys who requested this. This was done through Instagram. You guys private messaged me, so that's awesome. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Here we go. Oh, yeah. I like this beat too. Is that a oh, test? Yep. It's an exam. Uh -oh. I hate exams. <laughs> but this one looks like they it determines their career. <laughs> is he happy? <laughs> Why is he laughing? You'll, you'll end up laughing without control. Whatever you're stressed. Oh, he laughed. That inappropriate moment. Oh, no. You're going to jail, sir. You are charged with murder. Ha ha ha. I'd start laughing too because laughter is contagious, you know? Right. If my friends are laughing, I would be like, I'd be like, Everyone would be like, are we even watching the same film? Are, 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 am I like not listening and these people are listening? Hey, I'm Aruna Looks like he's always going to be beat up because he's laughing at stressful moments. <laughs> Laugh until your belly hurts. Why are cops shooting? Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, are you watching? <laughs> or am I not paying that attention exactly to this movie? That is exactly what he was thinking. Yeah. He's like, hold up. Yeah, wait. hold up, wait. Yeah. So what do you think? Does it look a super uh, I think my favorite part was probably the test at the beginning. Um, at first I was like, why is he laughing? Like, there is no way I'd be laughing in my exams. Like, that is a stressful time. And then once I found out that he laughs whenever he's stressed out, I was like, oh my gosh, I can relate. But everyone there was probably like, um, excuse me? <laughs> right. And insulted, the right? Yeah, and the teacher's yeah. probably even more insulted. Like, you think my class is a joke mm -hmm. kind of thing? So... Like, that is such a unique idea. Mm -hmm. Someone that laughs at inappropriate it, moments. Yeah. Stressful like, things. I think there probably are people like that, but I haven't seen a movie about it. <laughs> My favorite part was seeing the guy at the movie at the very last minute. Um, whenever <clears throat> he, like, started laughing, and then the guy was like, are we watching the same thing? Like, is there, like, are you, like, having out your phone? <laughs> like, are you... It is almost Are like you mentally ill. Like what, yeah. do you, what do you think? Is there like a funny thing in the background? What did I miss? My favorite part was seeing the gun. The Shut guns? Up. Yeah, the gun was pointed right at him, right? And he was like, ha ha ha! Uh, my favorite part was the dancing. The dancing looks legit. I want to see more of that. Yes, yes, I agree. And it was like mixed in the part where they were showing just clips and quickness. And so you really didn't get to see a lot of yeah. that all in one place. Um, I would say the part that stood out to me is when the girl broke up with him. 
because um, I could relate to that. Like if I had an intimate relationship with someone and they always laughed at the inappropriate moments, it would probably hurt my feelings. So I could see how she would get tired of that and break up with him. For sure. Yeah. So you have heard what we thought about this video. We would love to hear from you. Unfortunately, YouTube turned off our comments, so it's not as easy as going down below. But all you need to do is go over to Instagram and you can leave us all your thoughts there. We really hope that you do because we'd love to hear from you and we would love to see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Make sure you do your daily dab. Dab ting tong. I'm not excited about having people watch me. So who won the challenge? Me. 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 <laughs>you how are you doing we are life meets family and you might see our puppy's head yes. try to creep into this is bell you guys have met her on the live streams i'm sure so thank you so much for hanging out with us thank you so much for clicking our video we're life meets family and today we, we are reacting to world famous lover teaser i'm dan i'm amanda savage I'm Sunshine. I'm Emma. I'm Erin. And thank you guys if you recommended this video to us. Maybe we should get a pedestal for Belle to sit on. Yes. Her, her head could be right next to me and Big Man's. Like right yes. here. Right here. Right? Oh, you sweet girl. Yes. So thank you so much. Go, go ahead and click that, click that subscribe button to join our crazy family. We love you. Here we go. Go, go, go. Love is compromise. Sacrifice. There's a lot to see in the flashes. I want to do that. Oh my god. Rainbow? Looks like the tower. Oh! Yamane! I did not just burn your legs, Yamane! I loved you! What? I loved you, Yamane! Well, it started out with like party music and it ended with ominous and yelling music. And, and blood being on his face. Dang. So, Emma, what did you think about that trailer? Uh, well, first, I want to comment about how it comes out February 14th, Valentine's mm. Day. So, that's pretty cool. Interesting. Interesting. Valentine's Day in the United States. Is, uh, do they have Valentine's Day in India? I don't know. That's Maybe. a good question. Let but us know on Instagram. It kind of works out with the world famous lover. So, kind of. Mm -hmm. Love Valentine's. But uh, I think my favorite part was probably the end. He shows so much like passion. Like I feel like when he was like getting it, like I put so much faith into you. Like I loved you so much, and then you kind of just broke my heart, kind of thing. Yeah. And he put so much emotion behind it, so that was really cool. My least favorite part was whenever it like flashed from him like screaming, mm -hmm. and then from and then to him having blood on his face. So I don't what like is blood. Going on? Yeah. Yes. Blood is scary. Yes. Uh, Even though I have it in my body right now. <gasps> Belle, stop. Go. My favorite part was seeing the Eiffel Tower. That's kind of cool. Yeah. Have you guys seen that before? No. I've been on top of it. Inside but, Mommy's body. But you've never seen it. That's interesting. So, my favorite part was them skydiving. I love that. Uh, that's pretty awesome. But I will say, though, the music added a lot. And love makes you do crazy things. Like it's intense. What do you think, Mom? I agree. I think the music was one of my favorite parts. I enjoyed that transition yeah. from, you know, party at the beginning to <laughs> agony at the <laughs> end. Um, but I do always like the flashes yeah. where you just get a tiny little hint of what's going to happen in the movie. And it's just enough to hook you and make you want to see it. But you really don't know the story yet because... It's more enjoyable when you don't know the whole story, mm -hmm. when you actually get to watch it and learn the story. You don't want to see the whole thing in the trailer. You want just enough to be interested. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. What is your favorite, like, 
What was your, what's your favorite date that you've been on? Ooh. I haven't been on a date so mm -hmm. yeah. movies. movies. We taking you guys on dates. Oh yeah. My favorite For like I mean for four, I mean for February 14th. For Valentine's like, what, like, Day. like what would you want to do? I would want to go roller skating or ice skating. I want to go to a fancy not, restaurant. We have not done those two in so long. So, mm. Emma, you'd want to do what? On Valentine's Day, I'd want to go to a fancy restaurant. Like, but like on a normal day, I'd want to go to the movies. Like what would be a fancy restaurant? Like what like type of food? Like hibachi or like, because we usually go to hibachi on Valentine's oh, Day. We, yeah. We did or do that for a long time. I, didn't yeah. Yeah, we did. Hibachi or like, like a French restaurant or something. French, <laughs> French. Or a restaurant. French, French means, fast food. French means, uh, fast food. Fast food. No, French main no. is good. No, no I mean, like, you know fancy. how, like, they have, like, they, they, you pay a ton and then you get, like, an oyster. <laughs> you small you want that? Small no, portion. Well, I mean, it's fancy, it's right? Fancy. Yeah. Good for Valentine's Day. That's what they tell you is fancy. I mean, <laughs> no, it's, it's just an oyster. Like, it's so expensive and you get, like, one oyster, and if you go somewhere else, which is not fancy, you pay for you only pay like a little bit of money and you get so many. Yeah. So many oysters that yeah. are like just as good. Uh, do you who likes oysters? You do. I like clams. Oh, clams. clams. I like okay. oysters I like and clams. All right, so tell me what would be your pick for a, like a something to do on February 14th? Skydiving. Mm, I don't think if I'm you not. took your girlfriend on on Valentine's Day skydiving, I don't think she would be your girlfriend anymore. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty funny. I mean, unless she's like a daredevil, like there are Depends some on girls the girl. who would enjoy yes. that. But I would not. I'd be like, um, excuse me, take me on another day. So Which that is a valid point. Each person's perfect Valentine's Day would be different because yeah. every person is different, right? So <laughs> pick what your love loves and but and here's another deal is it's okay to do something different than other people and it's okay to find some someone who fits you yeah right like so if i wanted to go skydiving like for my free time and mom was scared of heights she wouldn't be a good fit for me and Bye -bye. i should probably find that out when we were dating right mom like it's okay to find out like when you're dating someone that they don't like to do basic stuff you like to do. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. it's okay to be picky when you're dating. Mm -hmm. Yes. Be picky. You know, then you marry the person that really fits it's you. Little, it's a little yeah. too late. So what would be my... I mean, now it's too late, of course. So <laughs> what would be my fa my thing to do? I like going out as a family. Um, but when me and mom celebrate it... Hello. Probably a good, like, steakhouse would be good. What yes. about you, Mom? Yeah, steakhouse. I like going out to a nice dinner. Do you guys like steak? Yes. Yeah, I like hibachi, though, better. We Some need steak. A... I like hibachi. Mm -hmm. Why are you looking at me? Look, look Some at the steak. Ribs. I would like to have ribs. Ooh, like, we ribs. have not had ribs. I like to have mashed ribs in mm -hmm. so long. Mm -hmm. Y'all are making me I would like to have waffles. Waffles. Okay. That's so, Mom, what, what would be your perfect... <laughs> For July, for, I mean, for July. You have February 14th date. I think I said I like going out to a nice dinner. Yeah. Yeah, I like it. Mm -hmm. Well, cool. Let us know what you would like to do on, like, a big date night. February 14th or just a normal Friday night with your... Friday the 14th. If it's your girlfriend or your boyfriend or your wife or your husband's birthday. Mm, that's, that's a, a big day. day. Yes. Yeah. yeah. That's good. So you can't tell us here on YouTube because YouTube has turned off our comments. So we invite you to find us on Instagram and leave us all your comments there. We also invite you to come back and watch another video with us tomorrow. Bye! Bye. Make sure you do your daily